Hey, what's up? This is Jonas. Welcome to this Click Video review. I'm here in the members area of Click Video. I played around with it. I put it into my autoresponder and I send a test to show you exactly what it looks like here on desktop and what it looks like on mobile. This is the light theme and here's how it looks if you have enabled the dark theme on your mobile. So it looks pretty good on all devices, desktop and mobile. And so what we'll cover in this video is how to use the email builder using all these elements, which you can see here. You can even add countdown timers, buttons, YouTube videos, Instagram posts and retargeting pixels. I'll show you exactly how that works in a second. Other than that, what you get with ClickVideo is 10 done for your email templates to get you started really easily. We'll also have a look at some of the done for your emails, which you will get included in the software. And here on the right, we'll have a look at some of the bonuses, uh, whether or not they are available in one or two months, I don't know. But at least for the launch of ClickVideo, these bonuses will be available. So we will talk a bit about that as well. Other than that, if you want more detailed information on the pricing and the click video upgrades, I'll have that on my full written review at the link below in the video description, as well as pros and cons, the conclusion. And if you do decide to get click view for yourself, I have a full list of 17 or maybe even more huge premium bonuses that you can get completely free for getting click view through this page. There's some of the fast action vendor bonuses from click view. And then there's my personal bonuses all about email marketing, email deliverability, how to write emails, and even one-on-one -on -one mentoring on email marketing. So check that out if you want to get it. And now let's get into the ClickView software. So I'm here in ClickView. This is what you'll see once you log in. I have all my emails saved here. If I have a lot of emails, I can search for the emails. So I recommend that you name your emails so they are easy to find in the future. Now, whenever you want to create a new email, you just click on new email. You name your email. For this case, I'm just going to type in click view test so we can test it together. So next thing is, do you want to choose a template or do you want to create an email from scratch? Now you can also create your own template by clicking on create from scratch and then you can save it and use it in the future over and over again. Now there's 10 different email templates. Some of them are good, some of them, I mean, it depends on your style. So really, you can just choose any of these and you can take it from there. Let's just take one of the templates here. This is a very basic one with a button, white text, a logo at the top and social media icons at the bottom. If you want to change any of this, you can click on this and you can go to settings. And here you enter in the link URL of the image. For the text, you can go here to text. You can change the color of the text. You can change the font of the text. And there's a good selection of fonts. More fonts available than with your regular all responder. So that's really nice. You can change the size, the weight, which means if it's bold or not. And you can change line height. And so, for example, if you don't like that it has these lines here, you can change this so it's more compact like this. But personally, I like it like it is here. For the button here, as you can see, you can change the button text, click here. You can change the font, you can change the image, um, the color, the background color of the button. And here you paste in your link where you want people to go. This target right here just means that it opens in a new window, so I would not mess with that. So what you can do from here, is you can type in your email under social icons. You can go here and again, you can type in your Facebook, your Twitter, your Pinterest. If you don't want Twitter, you just delete. And if you want a new one, you just add a new network here. Maybe you want your Instagram and you just type in your Instagram link here and it'll show here at the bottom. So with that being said, it's very intuitive. If you want to add anything, you can go here to content and maybe you want to add a YouTube video, for example. So if you want a YouTube video, how this element works is that you click on the link here, you have where you want people to go. So it doesn't have to go to a YouTube video. The purpose of this video element is just to paste in 
a thumbnail so people can see that you are wanting to send people to a video and it's really easy if you for example wanted to send people to the review page right here that I created for you you can click the link below in the video to see it let's say this was the real video and let's see let's say you wanted this video in your email then you would just copy the link go to YouTube video ID you would paste in the link and just delete this here after WV after question mark V equals like this and it will take the thumbnail and automatically paste it in here and if you wanted to send people to your page you'll just copy the link to your page and paste it in here let's say we are happy with the email or maybe we want to change the logo first so in order to change the image here the logo right here you just have to use a link so you have to host your image somewhere for me I have my logo here hosted on my WordPress site so let's just paste in the link right here and so right now it doesn't look too good that's why you want to go to sizes and you want to look at your dimensions here so this is 500 by 144 so here I'm gonna type in 500 by 144 I'm gonna lock the height and then I can change the width to say 200 or 300 I'll say 250 okay so it's pretty intuitive what else you can do here is that you can put in your retargeting pixels if you're doing retargeting this preview text basically means the sub headline which you'll see here whenever you have an email like this you'll have the subject line right here and then there is like a sub headline that shows up here usually that's the first paragraph of your text but you can change this to be anything you want using the click view preview text option here so before we get into deploying the email into your autoresponder let me just show you a few more of the elements so you know how it works here as I'm showing you this let's take the location and I also want to show you the countdown timer so for location, if you are an agency, maybe this will be useful. Just type in any location here. You can resize it. And you can put a link to anywhere you want. If you want to delete anything, you just go here, click delete block. Let's delete that. Let's go back to content. And now let's try the countdown timer. So here we have a countdown timer. And what we want to do is we can enter in the date and here we have the time okay i think size is good here we can see a preview of the timer and that's that we can even link to anywhere we want if people click on the timer if you want a divider at the bottom you can do that you can change the width of this divider you can also make it dashed or dotted or change the color to your favorite color like so okay so that's pretty much it for the elements as you can see we did everything we played around with it we played around with the text the bold the italics the underscore we can make the text bigger here we insert a link so anywhere we want and so it's very intuitive to use now before let me just get back to this let me delete the timer and now let's preview the email so all you have to do is click on save email you can preview it here here's how it looks on desktop here's how it looks on tablet and here's how it would look on mobile if you don't like this too much padding here, it, you, know, you see the white space right here. If you want this white space to be a little wider, you can go ahead and click on the box. You can go to padding and you can change this. So let's say 10 like this, click save, click preview and look at the mobile preview. And now it's a little bit less. You can even get it as, as far as to the corner right here and to the edge right here. So. Once you're happy with your email, you save it and what you do is that you download it as a HTML output. So that will download a file right here. And what you want to do is you want to open it up 
in a notepad and you simply copy this text you go to your all responder for example aweber and when you want to create an email you want to look for the html editor most email all responders have a drag and drop a plain text and then there's the html or raw html or custom html it depends on whatever your all responder uh, names it as so i'm going to click on html editor and all you would have to do is simply just click on the this one html paste in the html click on save then i can enter in a subject line subject line a little test and click on preview and test so now i can see how the email will look this is for aweber i also did it with um, drip as you can see here this is how I paste in the email. It depends on your all responder, but all major all responders does have this available. You just got to find the right terminology. And that's very easy to do if you know your all responder. If you don't have an all responder, don't worry, because one of the bonuses that you get with ClickVO is, is two months free of MailVO all responder, which is an all responder by the VO team. Very, very high quality. All responder that has great deliverability and so you can use this all responder if you're using this as well on this all responder you can check out the link below in the video description and it will take you to this full written review page so before we go ahead and wrap this video review up let me just talk to you a little bit about the MJML technology while I show you some of the done for your emails that you get inside the click view software and then we'll get to some of the bonuses that I highly recommend you grab if you do decide to get ClickView for yourself. And we'll also talk about one of the all responders that I did not have a good experience with using ClickView. So as I talk about the MJ ML technology, just look at the screen and you can see here all the niches for the done for your emails right here on the right. And here's a lot of emails. Okay, so let me just talk to you about this technology the click view offers while you can have a look at the emails okay so basically the mjml technology is a new type of technology when it comes to email renders usually all responders use the normal html output which is outdated by now and it makes the html very heavy and not mobile responsive for mobile devices so that is a huge issue when it comes to spam and promotions because esps like gmail outlook yahoo they will most likely put your emails in the either spam or the promotions folder if your email is too heavy with html so if you put too many links or too many buttons or too many images then your email may end up in the spam or promotions folder but with this MJML technology, your emails will not only look better on all devices, but they'll also inbox a lot better. And that has been proven by numerous tests conducted by the ClickVO team and the ClickVO partners, showing huge increases in opens, click-through rates, and of course, revenue. So that's one of the main reasons why you want to get ClickVO. Of course, another reason that I really like is that it's so easy to actually create the emails and as you can see you get a lot of done for your emails if you are having trouble with writing emails yourself so if you do want to get click view for yourself i have created a very very nice premium bonus bundle uh, what you can do is you can click the link below this video description and you can check out all the bonuses here for example inbox assassin which is a members area that i created with me and my mentors and we show you how to increase your email deliverability by adding free crucial records. You really want to do this with any all responder that you do. We also have training videos on how to write emails. And there's even seven done for your emails every week in the MMO or internet marketing niche. There's also one-on-one -on -one mentoring with me. If you want any advice on email marketing, I've created a follow-up cheat sheet on how to write emails and how to convert new leads into sales fast. 
I've also got a lot of done for your emails here for you. If you are an agency, I've got done for your emails for you. I've got done for your funnels for you. I have everything that you need in order to be successful with email marketing. I also reviewed the autoresponder that you get for free as a bonus called MailVeal, and I'll leave a card right here so you can check out that review if you want to. But basically what you just need to know is that Neil Napier is behind ClickView and he has a lot of products that he always keeps up to date and really supports for the long haul. So that means you are covered and won't be left in the dark in one month, two months, three months or even a year from now. I only had one issue with uh, the Kartra autoresponder. Uh, apparently this autoresponder does not have a raw HTML or custom HTML editor and so what I did was I pasted in the code here apparently according to the preview it looks like this so the buttons are a little bit screwed at least on this preview but in my inbox it looked not that good so here's how it looked for the Kartra autoresponder it has some issues with the social media buttons like this and the video like this and uh, so all other all responders than Kartra will be good because most all responders support this raw HTML output so with that being said thank you for watching this click video review if you have any questions please leave a comment below this YouTube video or if you want to get in touch with me personally, you can do so here by going to the full written review page. The link is in the description below. And there's a link here to my Facebook and my Instagram. And you can also talk to me on my email at jonas at marketingwithjonas.com. All the other information, as you can see here, is right below. So with that being said, thanks for watching this video. And I'll see you either on the inside or in another video. Bye for now.